Hi guys, on this adventure day, we're going to be doing a little kayak tour. As you can see, I'm getting my kayak up on top of my car right now. Nice, bright and early in the morning. Getting ready. Hi, right, is everybody ready? Alright, here we go. Get ready, because we're heading out. We'll go to the same spot I found two 12-pound uh, K-Shot uh, Bowman's hat. So, could be possible. I've hit it pretty hard, but we'll see. Alright, let's get going. Alright, we are in the river here, and uh, we're going to check out I actually got a piece of a shell out of this little bank right here one time. I'm not all the way down to where I want to go yet, but I'm going to just check a couple of spots here. As you can see, the bank has eroded away a little bit. And that's what you look for after these high tides, you know, when you have some really running tides to here. Kind of eat the bank out a little bit, you want to kind of check it out a little bit. So that's what we're going to do right here for just a few minutes. And then we're going to head on downstream in the kayak. All right, let's give it a shot here real quick. All right, check it out. First stop, first file. We got a Civil War bullet right here it, when we left the dock here. That's awesome. Already found a bullet. That's pretty cool. All right, let's keep getting up. All right, I didn't have my digger tool with me. I got a hit right here. So I had to go back and get my digger tool see what we got here. Uh, I just hit something, I think. It sounds like it could be a shell frag or something here, maybe. I don't know. Kind of tough though, because it's kind of deep right here. And I can't get a good bite on it. Ah, oh, I'm hitting something. We're hitting something up here. Okay, let me uh, cut this camera off so I can dig a little bit and we'll check it out. All right, I got it. Oh, check it out. I think it's a shell frag. Let's clean it up. Looks like I can see a, a case shot right there on the edge. I think this is a shell frag with case shot still in it. Is that awesome or what? That's pretty cool there. That's a cool find. All right, I'm not gonna try to clean up yet. We'll wait till we get to a little better area to clean this up and knock off some of this uh, conglomerate on it and see what we got, but I'm pretty sure I see a case shot right there. Isn't that awesome? All right, let's keep getting out. I'm gonna keep checking this here a little bit more. Well, wasn't really gonna stop here, but after two hits and two finds, I got to keep checking it out. All right, let's get it. All right, this is another little spot that I stopped with Gary one time. We picked up about 10 bullets here. Kind of clean up, but look here. I think I got me a hit here. 68, 60, 74, 76. I think that's a bullet, we all think. Let's see if we can get out here and get it now. Let's see if we can get in here and get it. All right. I'm not getting any hit with the pinpointer. So, it must be deeper. Yep, definitely got to be deeper somewhere in here. Oh, what? Got a little hit right there. There it is. All right, getting a hit right here. It's down in here. I feel something. Not yet, though. It's deep. Whatever it is, it's deep. I think I got it. What is it? Whoa! It's a bullet. I can see it. Dropped it down. Here it is. Oh, yeah, it's a bullet. It's just a mashed bullet. Look at that. Yep, definitely a three ringer. Crushed completely. So, I've had five hits today and three relics. That's not bad. Let's keep up the momentum here. Keep getting up. All right, let's put it up. All right, guys, this is pretty or what? Out here in nature and just enjoying life and finding relics at the same time. You can't go wrong. Alright, check all these bugs on top of the water. They'll start cru cruising out of here when I get close. Watch them. I don't know what they are. You see them around here a lot, though. Alright, here we go. Come on. Come on, buggies. Where are you going? There you go. Look at them all taking off. That's funny. All right, I've been digging on this guy for about 10 minutes. It's definitely a shell frag. There's definitely a lot of uh, shells that hit here because I've dug a lot of shell frags here in the past. This one was down about three foot under the bottom, but definitely a shell frag. All right, we'll keep looking. Here we go. All right, check it out. Here we go. We got another shell frag. Right here in the same area I got the other two shells from. So there were others blowing up in this area. Nice little shell frag. Alright, I'm going to keep digging them out of here. 
Oh, I just dug this out. It's a piece of lead. I think it might be from a bullet. And it could be a gardener bullet, maybe. I have double sided. I'm not sure. But definitely from some kind of a. Uh, from the Civil War, some kind of bullet or K shot, one or the other. Yep, alright, we're still digging them out. Alright, I might have to dig it under rocks here and everything. I had to move this big old rock out of the way. Another shell frag. Right there. It was buried way down in there. People hit this spot pretty good, but there's still some buried in here. But I would like to find a whole shell, but not looking too promising right now. And looks like we got us another bullet. I think it's a sharps. Sweet. That's a, that looks like an unfired bullet almost. Sweet. Maybe I'm in a little spot now. Alright. Here we go. Gonna get some more. Yeah, butterfly laying right next to me here on a flower, pretty flower. Check him out. Oh, there he goes. Are y'all ready for this? Check out the shell I found. Look, I saw it sitting in the water just like that. And now I turned it over. It's a turtle, turtle shell. Oh man, I thought for sure I had something when I saw that. Oh well, let's keep looking. The day's still young. We might still find something. All right, let's get it. All right, I think we'll call that a day. It's a pretty day, it's a nice day, good weather. I love it. I'm glad y'all came along with me. I hope y'all enjoyed the trip. Uh, we'll get back home and take a look at everything we got. And also show you what I got the last time I was here. So stay tuned. All right, we're back home safe and sound. That's always a good thing. All right, let's check it out what we got here today. All right, as y'all saw in the video, shell frags was an item of the day today. Got five different shell frags today. Uh, they're kind of small shells, but there's there's a lot that went off in that area, so that's why. I uh, got three um, bullets. I think this is a sharp. Doesn't look like it's been fired. I think this might be a sharp too. Looking at it, it's crushed, but it looks like it's only two lines on it right there, and the bottom kind of looks like that bottom of the sharps right there. And this is a th regular three ringer here. And dig his mother lead in it. It probably came out of one of the shells that got fired. I uh, got a got a big old square spike, old timey stuff, square nail. But what I wanted to show you is last time I was at this exact spot, I got this right there, twelve pound Borman, and it's the guy that, that disarmed that said that is a K shot. They can tell by the weight on them. And what a different! I want to kind of show you what a K shot is here. This is a K shot. What it is, they take with the fuse out, they fill it full of uh, these lead balls. Then they take a drill and drill a hole down into it, and then they put the powder. That's only that much powder in the, in the shell, which is amazing to me, because uh, you think it'd be full of powder, but it's only that much powder, that one little hole, and it explodes this thing up and throws these sh uh, balls out everywhere, and kills anything close to it, probably. But they use a matrix like a tar or some kind of sulfur or something to kind of hold it all together while, before they drill it out. It's pretty cool, though, how it looks, isn't it? This, this was a really good shape one, too. You see the fuse on top. They punch how many seconds. It's got like one, I forgot how many, five seconds, whatever. They punch a hole and it'll burn around that center thing until it hits the main fuse for that many seconds when they fire, the, fire it out of the cannon. Pretty cool. All right, well, had a good day today. Pretty day. Um, and enjoy it. I hope you all enjoyed your trip along. And hopefully you come along for the next one. It won't be long. All right, stay tuned.